running over top. And you can see this actually looks like it's, it's cut in. There's material thickness, and then there's that hole right in there. All right, let's put back our, let's lock this. Let's put back our mesh. So as you can see, we have our gradient mesh and this material, the two materials. So we'll copy paste again, we'll combine them together expand and what we'll do is we'll select this we can make a little swatch of it here that'll keep our angle and our sizing and you use your eyedropper tool with your material new material selected and there goes it adds it in there delete that all right now Again, we need to take this, move it behind. All right. There we go. So it's starting to take shape now. Let's, let's perform the same, same deal here. Those will go black. If we select all of these, let's change the stroke to 0.25. And this material here will get the same red treatment to it. 